everybody, and welcome to my tutorial on how to transfer DS emulator or any DS save file Pokemon to Pokemon Battle Revolution on Dolphin. First, you want to open your internet browser of choice. I use Chrome, then go to Dolphin emulator, and you can see the first one, dolphin-emu.org, that is the one you want to go to. And then you will see this giant download dolphin button, C click that and to download the latest release. Something to note, you will need the latest Visual C++ redistributable, so just follow this link. But just download Dolphin. I'm just going to put it on my desktop for this tutorial. So once Dolphin is done downloading, extract it with your software of choice. I use 7-zip. I will put the link in the description. So we'll just extract it here. It'll Extract it. So we delete the 7D, we don't need it. Open the dolphin folder. And optionally, I like doing this, create a text file called portable.txt. That'll just save your dolphin stuff in your dolphin folder. So open the exe. Give it a minute. It'll give this prompt. I say whatever, I just say no here. Then it'll ask, Dolphin could not find any GameCube, Wii, ISOs, or WADs. Double click to set a game directory. So double click. And find where your ROM of Battle Revolution is. For the sake of this tutorial, I put it on my desktop. So we're gonna open that. See, Pokemon Battle Revolution is right there. So set up your controller if you like, but for this example I just have the default mouse and keyboard controls, so we're going to go with that. So you're going to want to create a save file at this point, so I will speed up the footage. So here's the fun part, yeah, so you want to go back to your internet browser and search for PK Hex. just go to the Project Pokemon. You will need the net framework, I think, there is a prereq to this, but it'll give you a pop up if you don't have it, just download it, I think it's safe, it's from Microsoft. So I'm just putting that out there now because I remember having to do it. Extract the PK hex zip file as well and delete the zip. Now we can close our internet browser, we don't need that. So we need to grab our DS save and the Pokemon Battle Revolution save. So I have my DS save on my desktop for this tutorial. But to get your Battle Revolution save, you want to go back to Dolphin. To refresh so the yeah, there's a save file because there's a banner. Right click, open Wii save folder. Go into the Genius PBR folder. This is your save, this file right there. So we wanna open PK Hex. Just going to window. Open two instances of PK Hex. The S is for backup folder to the ES. Open the second instance, close that on one end, click your DS save, like that. On the 
other. Put the PBR save. So the reason why we opened the storage menu earlier is because it would give you a corrupted save error. I don't know why it does that. Just you can close out of that. No. So all you need to do is your Pokemon from your save. Dragon trap them. save out now that I had open. There's one more step you need to do that's very important. Go to the SAV tab, block data, and then in the display, SID, and TID, just put random five-digit numbers. I just, I just do this. There we go. Change close, hit file, export the save back out, hit save, replace, it'll be like save, exported, the yada yada yada, just hit OK. Look like a hex, close this, and then you should just be able to launch the game. So I will show that off now. And that's, and that's how you transfer your DS Pokemon to Dolphin Battle Revolution. It really is that simple. I haven't seen anyone on the internet cover this for some reason. So let me know if it helped. Bye.